star of the show. And this will be the injector. I'm going to show you uh, injector.c. Let's first, uh, we'll come back to this get process ID in a second. But here's our main function. The first thing that we're doing is assigning the path, the direct path to where the DLL file is. Now note, when you create this, you have to build and it will be automatically created. You won't have this basically uh, without a build being done, building your solution. The process name that we're looking for is notepad.exe. Next, we're going to go ahead and call get process ID, which scans a system to find uh, the process ID or PID for notepad.exe. In this instance, it will be searching for 5184. We already have it running here, but essentially get process ID, which is this code right up here. We'll go ahead and get it, uh, the process ID, and hopefully it's found. But if not, could not find the process ID. We will then pass this on to open process. This is where we're asking the Windows kernel, hey, I need a handle for this process. 